guys, today we are going to talking about how you can create your one landing page with your 3D model for your product. So you can create beautiful responsive design page that have your products, you sell them, but as a 3D model so the user can react with like for example the user when see the product here on the left side he can see the product rotating by himself in 3d and he can get the mouse and touch the, the product so this is going to give the user uh, a good feeling for the product and make the possibility to pay the products more stronger so today we are going to talking about how you can create in that for your product so you can start selling in this technique to get more uh, traffic and start uh, grow your selling and make more money also so you can see here we are having a short introduction about the products like with content the title of the products and short introduction description inside the title and here we are seeing the prices and we have a beautiful pay now button so we are linking this button with the original product so this is a 3d model product and the user can react with as we say to be your landing page for your product and this is it's going to be the button the user when he click on it is going to redirect him to the real product that you are selling uh, so the user can simply edit the product to his uh, cart inside the website your website and he can pay the product so this is great technique to beat more uh, salts for your product. So let's show how you can do that. So simply to do that, uh, you have first of all go to speechfab.com. This uh, website have uh, 3D models. The same of them are. Uh, Free and other of them are paying for uh, 3D model. So you have to go and check this website first and log for the product that are recording to your uh, meeting. So in my case, I did search for a 3D model and I find this model right here to use it inside this video because this is a microphone and the product we are selling today is a microphone so after you find your product you scroll down you have to make sure it's free not paying product and when you find your product you have you go to scroll down the bit right here then you are going to find this button right here say download 3d model and when you click on it going to be this pop-up right here and you have to scroll down a little bit then first of all you have to download this gltf file right here and you download it after you download it you copy this uh, code right here because it uh, created a uh, creator so you have to edit it inside your website in Word to write for the creator. So in this case, we are going to download this gntf file after we download it and we copy this uh, text. I mean this code right here. So I already downloaded them and after that, after you download your zip file, you go to your WordPress dashboard and you have to make sure that you have file manager because this uh, plugin is going to allow you to unzip the file that you are 
already downloaded for your 3D model inside your WordPress dashboard. So after it the plugin, you go for the plugin on your left side in the dashboard for your WordPress. After that, you click on File Manager. And then scroll down. Here, I already edit the products, but for you, it's going to be like this in HTML public. So you have to go and looking for WP content. After you find WP content file, you click on it and you go for upload. You look for upload file and you click on it. And here you can create a folder or edit your uh, 3D model inside any folder inside these folders right here. Like for example, in my case, I edited it inside this folder 2023. And you go to your zip code, you drag and draw your zip code right here, zip file right here. And after you get it, the file right here, it totally uploaded. You click, right click on it, and you go to extract file here then you choice here then you click and you wait until it's going to extract the file on zip the file after he extracting you look for the file called science.gltf science.gltf this file right here so after you make sure that you have the file right here inside your wp file manager you go and create a new page after create a new page so here in this case it's going to back for you if you want the page be for wait or you want the page stay have your menu but in this case you are going to keep in the page with uh, the menu but you can also make like a beautiful landing page uh, without the menu or anything so simply go to settings and you go to page layout then it's going to be by default you have to keep make it uh, elementor canvas so when you make it elementor canvas it's going to be full weight so they are nothing no menu no description nothing but if you want the menu simply go back to settings and go to page layout then from elementor canvas you make it elementor full weight and it's going to be with uh, the menu but they are not sidebar sidebar or anything so it's go back to, to you how you want to make your landing page for your product okay so after you are uh, making your page as you choice you simply go to this plus icon right here you click on it and you choice these two columns right here right so after we have these two columns right here you go to this icon right here then you go for html and you drag and drop html inside this column Okay, so after you have HTML inside this column, I will leave the code inside this video in the description. You can uh, use it. So all you have to do, copy and paste the code right here. Okay, so go to the code, you copy the code, then you paste it right here. Right, so you are not going to see anything in this case, but don't worry. So all we have to do is very simple. After we edit our uh, code in this uh, HTML code right here, so we have to go back to our uh, WP file manager and we go to uh, scenes.gltf and we click on it, right click. 
and we go to get info and we click on get info and in the link we have to click on this link here we have to click on it and it's going to open for you this page so here all you have to do you have to copy this link right here the whole link you copy this whole link then you go back to elementor inside your page where you are building the, the landing page then you go inside the code then you go to script and inside script right here uh, sorry you go to model uh, viewer inside edit your gltf file you edit your glt uh, gltf file right here, the, the link that we have just uh, copied so we passed it right here. Great, our 3D model is here. So after you passed it right here, it's going to be inside your page. So if you want to change the background color, all you have to go to advanced and inside advanced, you are going to go to the background and here it go back to you which color you want to edit so you can show it any color that you want and uh, yeah that's it so after you show it the background color if you want to change it you click on update to say your changes after that you go back to these icons right here and you go to get uh, um, title and you drag and drop this uh, here in this corner and here you can type whatever you want so for your title okay so after you edit your description like your uh, whole description for your product and you edit the price and everything so here you have first of all to make sure it's responsive but before to make sure it's responsive we are going to edit a button and link it with the original page that we are selling our uh, product so we get the button and we add the product the button right here then you can uh, resize the button and change uh, the, the text inside the button like this one right here so Begins. We are going to design our button. So, colors, color, it's an example, and we can uh, change the borders, make them like 10. We give it shadow, we can change the color for the shadow. So it's go back to you how you want your landing page to look like. So you keep try to design that you are happy with. So let's say that you like this design for example right here. And you have to put in the center. We go to content right here, we go to line and we it in the center. Right, so after we make our landing page with our 3D model here, so all we have to do is all, all we have to do is to make 
make sure the responsive model is right here. So we go to type box and we see it is responsive and we go to mobile and we also check if it is responsive. So when we are totally happy with we can simply update it. After we update it, the final result is going to be like this. So this is how you can simply create your 3D model for your uh, landing page. And for the button to link it with the product, you simply go to your product uh, page. That's where you are editing your original page for your product. You go get the link, copy the link, then go to back to your uh, Elementor page that where we are uh, creating our landing page and you go to button, you click on button, then you go to link and you edit your one link right here. Here you have more options, you can make the link open in a new window or you want to make the link open inside the same window so to go back to you if you want it to be inside your window you have to check this box right here if you don't so just and check this box right here and you update so after you do that you are ready to go so all your page blending beautiful with uh, 3d model uh, products it's ready so when the user click on the pay now button it's going to redirect him to your uh, re real page where you are selling your product so the product where he's linked with your uh, woocommerce plugin inside your wordpress uh, website so you can start get more traffic and go yourself so this is great technique to get uh, attractive uh, uh, model for your product so this is for today and hopefully this video helpful i will leave all link inside the description to use them and the script also so uh, see you in the next video